Okay, wow. So, uh, yeah, people uh, got that mystery book challenge, I guess that's what we're calling it now, uh, pretty fast. So, um, I thought it would I was pretty obscure, but uh, I guess not. Well, they recently got a um, new season of their TV series after like a 15-year-long hiatus or whatever. No, five-year-long hiatus. Now, even shorter than that, they had a they had a miniseries before that. Anyway, it was Red Dwarf: Better Than Life uh, by Grant Naylor, which is a portmanteau of the actual authors Rob Grant and Doug Naylor. So, um, the first person to get guess that was uh, Diamond Sven. Diamond Sven. That's diamond without a D. Um, but he opted not to have, uh, not to get the, uh, not to receive the 30 second message prize. So, uh, that went to the next person who guessed correctly, which was Ego Angel. That's Angel with two L's. So that's, uh, that's a diamond without a D and an angel with two L's. Eh, that's, uh, that's interesting. Uh, <clears throat> And you'll hear that um, that message at the end of this particular video. But uh, this brings to mind the fact that, uh, first of all, I need to pick harder books because that was way too easy. People guessed like within the first hour of the video going up what it was. So that's um, that's great that uh, that people know what that book is and need to pick harder books. Uh, the second thing is I probably should not pick the exact first person who guessed correctly because that seems unfair to everybody else, everybody who guesses after that. So to make it more fair, I'm probably going to leave the video, the mystery book challenge open for like a day or two or three or however long it takes before the trickle of entry slows down. Then I'd take the names of everyone and then I put in a big random number generator and then it can... Um, Pick the winner for me. Does anybody know any good random number generators out there? Anybody at all? Because that that would be really helpful for the purpose of this um, exercise. Anyway, as the winner of the mystery book challenge, as part of the hundred days of narration challenge, um, Ego Angel decided to get me to record a little bump for a stream he likes called Vine Sauce Vidya, and here it is. Being trapped on Vine Sauce. I can't think of anything worse. Remember, you're here forever. VineSauceVidya.com That's V-I-N-E-S-A-U-C-E-V-I-D-Y-A dot com.